Hey guys, how's it going? Ruben here from the Midnight Garage. Today I am going to show you how to remove the sound deadening or tar mats from the back of your car. People, uh, I don't know, I've seen people do this and they were working on it for hours and I know a short trick that you're probably done in a couple of minutes. So I'm going to show you guys and it's going to save you guys a lot of time. Now, one thing I do want to say, if you're going to do this, uh, the car will be a bit more rattly and noisy. So yeah, that's basically the trade. If you lose about two to four pounds of weight and your car will be a bit noisier than it was before. So yeah, do it at your own risk. Well, the car we're going to test it out on is my Kanjo Style DK and it's better known in the YouTube comments as fucking piece of shit riser trash car. That one. Yeah, I do read the YouTube comments. I just don't really care that much. You guys can have your own opinion, right? Either way. There we have some lovely sound deadening and we're going to remove it. Well, when I see people do this, I see them use heat, like a heat gun or fire or whatever. That's the dumbest thing ever. Don't do this because it will melt it and it will stick even more and you're going to spend hours doing it. Now, the second method is using dry ice. And dry ice is good, but it's expensive to buy and it's expensive to contain because otherwise it's going to melt. And you have to have like a container or something. It's going to cost a lot and it's, it's an okay method, but there's a better method. Well, the method I'm using is using this. It's called freezer. It comes in a can and you can freeze it. Oh, no shit, Sherlock. It's time to test some out. You need the freezer and you need a hammer. And let's see how it works. See? Let's do some more. There, isn't that easy? Well, yeah, based on what you can see here, what I can do in like, I don't know, 30 seconds, pretty much in five or 10 minutes, you've done the whole car. And I don't know, I think you need two cans of these tops to do everything. So this has been fun. Now you know this trick, you can probably do this with a lot more ease than you did before. And this has been well-groomed and short-haired Ruben. Now back to you, long-haired Ruben. Why, thank you, short-haired Ruben. I know my hair is pretty long. Maybe I'm going to cut it in the future. Anyways, uh, just to add, you can get this stuff at pretty much any car shop. Just ask for it if you can't find it. And this was the video, so yeah, I hope you liked it, leave a like if you did, and I'm going to do a few more of these, so yeah, if you want to see more of these how-tos, then hit the subscribe button, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!